So, today, uh, we're seeing our two girls, the five-year-old and the eight-year-old. And, but before that, before that, I'm going to go and I'm going to find a pair of swimming trunks for Saturday. a small window to get this done so hopefully the place that I'm going to has something that I can get and I don't have to sit there look around look around look around just find it buy it and leave I'm a guy that's what we do so I got what I wanted and it was only 350 so that's cool I'm gonna try them on when I get home, make sure they fit properly though. You don't want shorts that are too small. Trust me. All right, so I'm back at home and I've got time to try these shorts on and see if they fit. Okay, so they fit. That's good, yeah. They're not too loose, they're not too tight. Pretty much perfect, so. Oh, and they have pockets, nice, I like that. All right, so these are my new swim shorts. And, uh, which means, stop wearing these as swim shorts and probably just use them as everyday shorts there's nothing wrong with them it's just they're not good for uh, for swimming in so yeah I could wear these as normal everyday shorts But probably not every day. <laughs> but you know what I mean. So. It's windy. <laughs> Holy crap, it's windy. Never mind. Wow. <laughs> it's not one thing, it's another. You know, first wind, now a train. There's a train somewhere back there. Anyway. Um, I'm on my way to the Forks uh, to see my two youngest girls. Um, Jasmine's already there. <sighs> so I am taking a shortcut through the bushes by the river. So there's the river. Oh, there's the train. Somewhere back there. Anyway. Um, so yeah, so I'm walking through here and it'll get me there. Uh, if you're not sure what the Forks is, uh, it's a big tourist attraction place, tourist destination, a lot of tourists there, and a bunch of kids playing Pokemon. I don't know, it's weird. Uh, there's the river and the train tracks, but anyway. Um, yeah, uh, you're online, obviously, you're watching this on YouTube, so you must have access to the internet. Uh, do a Google search, The Forks in Winnipeg, and there you go, you got all the information about it and everything, and just in case I don't get any footage while we're there. Anyway, I decided that since I had the day off today, I would edit and save and upload the powwow footage that I have, right? 
I had at least an hour worth of footage. And I went to put it, you know, dropped it into my uh, video editing software. And most of the files were corrupt and I couldn't get them to edit. So uh, I took the files that I have. There's only four of them. And it's like eight minutes and 50 seconds. So that's all the footage that I have. And I'm saving it now. And once it's done saving, I'm going to take it upstairs and I'm going to upload it. So it will be uploaded by tonight before this vlog is over. So I don't know why I'm telling you this because you probably have already seen it on YouTube. <laughs> if you're subscribed to me. If you're not subscribed to me, go to my channel, go to my videos, and it should be the one right before this video, this vlog. So it's the powwow at the forks in Winnipeg, Canada. That's the title. I think he wants to come downstairs. <laughs> uh, he gets that way when he's lonely. Well, so much for that. Uh, does anybody know how to fix corrupted video files? Uh, so the four clips that I had, they're playing fine downstairs. And then they saved. And then I transferred them up here. And now it's just doesn't work. I'm not even going to try uploading it. I'm just going to count it as a loss. But I'm saving the files. I've got the files saved on a thumb drive. So if you can help me, um, you know, if you, if you know any way of uh, fixing corrupted uh, MP4 files, video files, let me know in the comments and I'll try that. I'll try anything. And eventually I'll get this footage uploaded. Um, for, but for right now, it's staying on the thumb drive and not going anywhere. And yeah, so I don't know. I don't know. It's not a waste. It's just a loss right now because I can't get it up. I, that did not come out right. <laughs> um, yeah, I can't get it uploaded. So I don't know. I'll just hold on to the files until I can find a solution and get those files uh, fixed. I know one time I did manage to fix corrupted video files and they worked fine, but I forget how I did that. So uh, anyway, anyway, moving along. I'm going to 7-Eleven. I'm going to get me a big giant Slurpee. Yep. <sighs> it's windy again. <laughs> um, yeah. Remember when I said I was determined to get Crystal Pepsi? I found it in Slurpee form. So... Yep, I got a, pep, a crystal Pepsi Slurpee for myself. <laughs> Phone made a weird noise. <laughs> but anyway, I got it right here. Crystal Pepsi. Yeah. 
So I walked into 7-Eleven, went to the Slurpee machine. It's the first thing I saw. Crystal Pepsi machine. It's crazy. So right away I had to get one for myself. <sighs> so I don't know. I had Jasmine's bank card with me and you know, she wanted a Slurpee. So you know, was using her money to get her Slurpee. But then I saw this and I checked my bank account and I had enough for both. So I offered to pay for her Slurpee as well. So I did. And then just as I was leaving 7-Eleven, I got a notification on my phone saying that my next Slurpee is free. So awesome. Gotta love the 7-Eleven app. <laughs> but anyway those uh, new shorts that I bought I, I realized after I made that little clip when I was trying them on when I took them off I noticed that uh, the back pocket no it was before I took them off I noticed that the back pocket right there was I didn't even know there was a pocket in the back and there was like some kind of plastic thing in the pocket. So I went and I dug it out. First of all, the pocket zipped. Hmm. So anyway, I ran out of room on my phone. So I just transferred everything that I had up until now onto my computer. <coughs> <coughs> anyway, um, where was I? Oh, yeah zippered pocket in the back right and there's this plastic thing in it and like did some kid leave a toy in there or something uh i don't know so i pulled it out and it's a it was a string with a little hook clip thing on the end of it and i'm assuming that that's for like the locker key when you go swimming so that's what i'm going to use it for i'm going to put the key in my back pocket so, yeah, zip it up so it doesn't, like, fall out or anything. Um, but anyway, yeah, I'm very happy with those shorts. They, they feel nice, and, you know. And, uh, the lady in the store said that they're, like, uh, they dry fast. So that's good because nobody likes taking a wet swimsuit home. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. But anyway, I'm probably running out uh, of room. <laughs> no, um, it's going to be a long vlog. <laughs> it's very rare that I have to transfer all my files before I'm done my vlog. So. But anyway... Ah, oh, this is good. This is good. It's a little fruity, but it's still pretty good. Anyway, um, yeah. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like this vlog. Comment on this vlog. Share this vlog. Do whatever you want with this vlog. Um, yeah. <laughs> Take it easy.